What gonna happen in, if, let's say, you know, during the relay race, it's like, you know, Jamaica and Canada, and it's like, mm. one, two, oh. one, two, like, which flag you gonna raise? That's the question. So tell me all about Olympic FOMO, because when we put, when we told the community, the community was like, hell yes! <laughs> we have Oxdale. Jerk yeah. chicken. Jerk chicken. Thank now watch this, so Brandon. Step up here, step up here, Jack. Brandon, come here real quick. So you see that? Watch, 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 watch. Easy, 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 easy. What is your favorite Celine track, though? Ooh, it would have to be, um, what does it mean for both of you to be back together? Mm. Right. FOMO is a pop culture thing, is fear of missing out. Right. Yes. We want to make sure that you don't have a fear of missing the Olympic Got you. coverage. Yeah. Yeah. Far, there's wherever, wherever you, wherever you, you go. You need the Titanic the song? Andre is also somebody who is really close to us as well too, cool with us, and we're very happy to see him going out there to compete. Andre we're doesn't know us. I don't know what he's, he's trying to do yeah. here. Andre's we good love us. him. Yeah, Andre's good with us. Yeah. We don't know us. Andre's good. So, Andre, sorry, I don't mean to be rude. Andre doesn't know her. Oh, you know them as the voices of Toronto. Now they're going to be the faces for the entire country for the Olympics. We have the legends. That is Mark and Jim on the Bee Gees show. First off, my guy. Gosh, look at this set. Olympic <laughs> FOMO with ding. Mark and Jem. Mm. Hot ding. new show. Jem. Look at earrings. Boom, boom, boom. We're so I'm excited. Right. Want me to get that for you? Let, I got that let, for you. Hold on, hold on. Let me flick off hold on. I'm flick off the next one. <laughs> Are we just leaving now? Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, oh. Ten four. I have to show them I have to get Ten four. The money a drop. Can we just show? Can we just show the money? The kicks. Can you see the money kicks? The money kicks. I can afford to flip my earrings. All right. Yes, Thank you for having us. Yeah. It's not official till you talk about it. So. Yeah, man, listen, we want to, first real, of all, though. we want to thank Brandon for everything. You've always supported us. You've always been there for us, whether we're on our way out or on our way in. Yes. You're always there for us. And when you say something, I go on, oh. them things are go on. So thank you for it? making it? it move, brother. Hold on. And it's really important for us mm -hmm. to let you know and let the listeners know nothing changes, mm -hmm. uh, you know, around here because we're here. Yeah. Right. We're just humble. We fit in. But you said ting, right? Yeah, I did say ting. Uh, yeah. Excuse me, can we get the uh, Can we get the patties and, and tings, ting, please, we? if you don't yeah. mind? Just All right, thanks what? so much. Brandon, you guys okay, what we do is don't worry about it. Don't worry about what we do. You we know, make so sure we, that we keep it you know I mean? Caribbean yeah, as just, far as we can. So Look at tings. You we know thought we'd bring a couple of tings for you. Hold one or two tings. Some patty and bun as well, too. Thank you so much. So we do the ting. Olympic FOMO is the place to be. Believe me, believe me. Look at tings. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. And we made it. Welcome. Welcome finally to Olympic FOMO with Mark and Jem. I'm your homeboy, Mark Strong Strizzy. Right, and I'm your girl, the gem of all gems, Gemini. And Olympic FOMO is all about making sure you never have a fear of missing Olympics again, because we're here for you. We got you in a different style and different vibe. We've all listened to the chemistry for right. years, mm -hmm. of course, to right. see you guys come back together, mm -hmm. you know, for the biggest sporting event that takes place mm -hmm. right. all across the world. Mm -hmm. right. And you guys are going to be talking about it. You guys are going to be talking so tell me all about Olympic FOMO because when we put when we told the community the community was like hell yes <laughs> <laughs> we love that we're so excited yeah. it's just we thought of how can we be that quick 10 15 minute catch up mm -hmm. because not all of us can afford to fly to Paris yes. you know what I mean? yeah. we can wear the shoes we don't have the money <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you um, and not all of us can take the time to go through the whole day yeah. but it's kind of like what we used to do when you're at work yeah. end of the day you go did you see this do you see that give you little jokes go online and just kind of make sure there's a reason you don't have a fear of missing out. Mm -hmm. yeah. We got you, like it's covered. And I think for people, I mean, most of our audience obviously knows what FOMO means, but mm -hmm. I'm glad that you said that because there are a few older folks, right. you know, right. who watch right. our content, who watch right. the show, and right. sometimes they might be like, FOMO, yeah. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna <laughs> right, so well, it's we fear like of the missing. Fact that we actually made a twist on it, and right. I think that's just really grabbing people, because right. FOMO is a pop culture thing, is fear of missing out. Right. Yes. We wanna make sure that you don't have a fear of missing the Olympic Got you. coverage. So yes. we put the O in there in a different format. Yeah. And of course, it's going to be Mark and Gem flavor, Mark mm -hmm. and Gem style. And we're going to bring out, you know how we do, we're going to bring yeah. our culture finally to another platform, bring it to Paris, bring it to global, national right. uh, mm -hmm. recognition. So we're happy, man. Mm -hmm. So talk to me. So is it going to be like daily? You guys are going to be producing content? Give mm -hmm. me all the details because you know the people are thirsty for, <laughs> for Mark and Jam. They are thirsty. They're parched. No Listen, question. We love it. And we yeah. got to big up CBC for yeah, you know believing CBC. in us and reaching out to us. Yeah, shout out to CBC. Yeah, yeah. man. We yeah, really appreciate it. You know we love CBC over here too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Listen, they love you. Yeah, yeah. well, CBC knows what it is now. Let me tell you 
people real. were like, Brandon's coming. Yeah, well, you know, I was like, Brandon's coming. Yeah, 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 it's that thing. Man, so this is, you know, iconic talent sitting right here. Right, so. right here, brother. You, you, you know, too. Right. Don't put take yourself out of that equation. So with so CBC, yeah, even we had a chance to sort of uh, pitch it to CBC. We're like, yo, we want to do this, but we want to make sure that we know how incredible CBC is with their stats coverage yeah. right. and with the gold medal runs and you know and uh, all the other um, specifics that happen throughout mm -hmm. the Olympics. We need that information, right. and they do an incredible job for it. But when we spoke to Shirelli, he was kind of like, you know what we need, though? Mm -hmm. We also need all those nuggets that you don't see all the mm, time. Right. All the yeah. stories that mm -hmm. you might have missed. Just because somebody came in eighth doesn't mm -hmm. mean that their story isn't as gold right. as the person who got gold. You know what I mean? Right. So we're now going to try and bring you a different format in a different way and also a different perspective right into your living room. And we also have people we'll talk to as well, too, right? Definitely. We're bringing in, uh, so of course we're going to speak to athletes, yeah. which is regular for Olympic coverage. But we are also bringing from the entertainment side, we're going to have singers, rappers, oh, reggae wow. stars, because we all, they all are fans. Yeah, yeah. And I also think, you know, sometimes you look at the actual athletes and they're listening to the, that music to hype them. Yeah. And we know that the musicians are hyped by that performance and they're fans like we are. So we're just bringing that extra level of entertainment and just kind of a little diversity and mm -hmm. shaking up things yeah. without trying to be a jerk. Yeah, you know about it. Did you say jerk? I did. Yeah. Denise, can you bring in the jerk chicken, please? We have a little jerk chicken for and Brandon. Jerk chicken. Chicken. I mean, if you don't just, mind, just bring in a little jerk, jerk chicken for it. Don't this is what the we budget <laughs> for Olympic <laughs> FOMO is budgeting. <laughs> the budget is budgeting? So the budget is budgeting. The budget is budgeting okay. over here. So we have a little jerk chicken, a little oxtail. Little, open it up, please. Just, we have some we have some plants in here as well. Smell of the oil. Yes. So listen, we want to big up the people at big up the people at What a Jerk downstairs. Big up the people at Trench shot, um, yes, yeah, trench shot over yeah, there as well. I'm too. just gonna just yeah. dive in just a little oh, bit, you know. No, please, it's like no, I'm gonna dive into Olympic FOMO. Oh, I like, so what, you there. I like what you did there. You don't want to have the fear of missing out on the oxtail. Fear of missing <gasps> out on <gasps> oxtail. <laughs> That's the new title. You heard it here. Fear Breaking of missing news. oxtail. Breaking, Breaking news. news. <laughs> Breaking news. Yeah, what? This oxtail is nice. And I don't need anybody's anybody's oxtail because everybody knows. No, no, it's not. Only my mom's eyes should Certain oxtail you deal with. Trust me. This one is nice. <laughs> Trust you know what it's like? <laughs> certain, I think there are people who, when you're mm. really in the culture, yep. you know that a mango mm. isn't just a mango. Mm -mm. Right. You'll have Julie yep, mango, Julie which I'm thinking mango. of Julie because I'm so excited about her being in Paris. I can't wait to cover that. Yeah. But you have Julie Mango. We have, you'll have. You know, wait, are, are you saying Julie Black's going to be in Paris? Are we talking yes, about saying Julie Black? Oh, I didn't know Julie, Julie Black's going to be in Paris. Oh, this is more breaking news for you. Breaking, breaking news. news. Jen, break it on me. Talk, talk, talk. Let him, let break it, it on let me. Him know why so I'm she's going to be at Canada House. I mean, I don't even know how much we were supposed to spill. Right. Spill right, Odyssey. Right. This is okay. where it all gets spilled. Are you crazy? She's going to be there. Gonna be there. Julie's also going to be on FOMO. She's going to reach out on FOMO as well, too. Yes. She's she's such a sweet person. Like, sweet like the Julie Mango she really itself. Is. She really is. Speaking of, Speaking I'm of so sorry. Uh, mangoes. Sorry, we, we talked about mangoes. Can we get some Julie mangoes what? in here? Just um, just really one quickly. Second. We have hold a whole on. lot of hold on, hold on, different hold on. ways of <laughs> making sure that Olympic FOMO well, no, just you know really Marketing represents. Changing. This is some Caribbean feel that we are yes. not going to let go of. So I'm they must it's, know we have patty. There was an memo that went out. Guys, no more apples and pears. And, yeah. And uh, you know so what? Amazing. Forget the apples and pears. Why don't we bring out yeah, all of the fruit there? I can't. Come on, Terry. Come on, Terry. I can't. So we have a full plot here of. We can put it right here. Yeah, girl. Patty and cocoa bread. Yeah. We have oxtail. Jerk yeah. chicken. Yeah. Jerk chicken. Thank now watch this, so Brandon. Brandon. Step up here. Step up here, Jack. Brandon, come here. No, 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 So you see that? Watch, watch, watch. Easy, 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 easy. Sure, no problem. No, no, no. No, hold two again up still. Yeah, there you go. No problem. This is how we want to do an interview with Brandon. Oh, my gosh. I don't even know where to start. Let me start with the chicken because, you know, I'm going to mess up my clothes because, you know, when you eat a mango. You have to be careful. Well, we did this content the other day about, you know, the new way to eat a mango. And people were like, obviously, BG, you know that's not how we do it mm -hmm. in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. You have to rip out the damn thing. Mm -hmm. I was like, obviously, guys, I know that's how you do it. We're just trying something it's different. It's a different thing. Yeah, Which is perfect because we're trying something different. Mm -hmm. This is it. a different thing for, for FOMO on mm -hmm. Olympics. And we, again, we really want to thank all the listeners out there. And yes. we want to tell the, the new listeners and new viewers out okay. there that the, although this is something new, it's something that will obviously be captivating for you because we are, are a group that we really want to focus on the fact that we have stories over stats mm. That's and those thing. stories are going to be the ones that are going to hold you they're right. going to, you're going to gravitate to because we all have an olympic 
uh, run that we like. Yeah. Right. We all wish we could have swam like somebody. Right. Mm. So we want to be able to bring that to you guys as well through the other athletes and entertainers that we'll be talking to. So who do you, like, who are you most looking forward to? I know Julie Black, obviously, mm -hmm. but in terms of athletes, like, mm -hmm. who, which athlete are you mm. really watching for the Olympics this Listen, year? Listen, man, my man Phil Wiz. Mm. We're looking at the breakdancing competition. Now, breaking competition. I know breakdancing this year. And on, I mean, man. we're hip-hop heads. That, yeah. like, that means the most to put it on that level for the world to really see. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's Phil's huge. from Toronto, yeah. lives in Vancouver. He has a big chance of getting a gold medal out there in yeah. Paris. Mm -hmm. He was out there last time about two years ago, only got the, the silver, or believe the bronze. So he has a reason to go back and get that gold. So I'm looking at me personally breaking with Phil Rizzo. And yeah. I have some more tea for you. More tea? Yes, Mark more tea. is going to be one of the voices covering Tell them, girl. the breaking Tell them, girl. event. <laughs> what? Crazy. Tell them, girl. Oh, God. <laughs> and everybody knows Mark's voice. Okay. You know. Okay. That's just iconic. Okay. Not only when you go to a Raptors game has he been holding us down for a year. Yeah, man. Right? Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right? So I can't wait to be commentating on that as well, too. Right. It'll be a two-day event with myself and Switch B. So look out for that. It's going to be fun. You yeah. know like you have the voice of God. Uh, listen, man. Like, no, no. For the rest it, of the day now, he's going to go, Brandon's like, well, thank you, Brandon. Show. Because if Morgan Freeman Brandon, ever, you, you know, decides to See? say he's uh, done. Do I appreciate it, Brandon. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so do you so the thing happening? is, Brandon, as we uh, so here in Fomo, is, uh, you know, I, I, we like the fruits of Fomo, so you know. Mm. <laughs> Mm. He didn't say you're from the States and you're a seven-year-old black man. <laughs> <laughs> you know who I think, you know, what might be a really cool sport to watch is obviously DeGrasse and mm. the sports So team much. Team. He's definitely one we're looking out for, for sure. I mean, I think they might bring home gold. I'm kind of hoping yep. for that. The drama, and that's the thing, there's so much story yeah. in that track world. Absolutely. Yeah. The rivalry, the drama, the reach, yeah. like, and, you know, your heart, everyone is just, and it's such a quick thing. Yeah. Like, it happened, You there's all this buildup, and it's just this exciting, quick moment. So yeah. I can't wait. Yo, yeah, Andre is also somebody who is really close to us as well too, cool with us, and we're very happy to see him going out there to compete. Even in, we're, we're going to do with the, uh, the the relay as well too. Andre we're doesn't know us. I don't know what he's he's trying to take yeah. loose here. Andre's we love us. him. Yeah. We love him. Us. Yeah. You don't know us. Andre, so, Andre, sorry, I don't mean to be rude. Andre here it doesn't comes. Know her. Here it goes. Oh, here it goes. Oh. Here it goes. Okay. What up, okay. Dre? What he up, doesn't Dre? know. What up, what up Dre? Dre? You have nicknames. That's my man. Guy, you got. If you've ever checked out Mark and Jem, you know he don't. He don't. What up, Dre? I'll talk to you later. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're fans like your fans and we're just really here to maybe give you a lighter take a different take on your favorite olympic sports and also make sure you have no fear of missing out okay honey let's at all. do it then all right. let's go it's time to get into trending, trending. Okay, guys, remind people yep. when they can watch uh -huh. and how often and where. Every <laughs> single night yes. uh, of the Olympic um, coverage, after coverage, the Olympic coverage, yeah. yeah. Um, it should be on, I'd say, about 7, 8 o'clock at night. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's on all platforms. So yeah. it'll be on YouTube, it'll be on CBC Gem, there's a podcast version of it, Amazing. and it'll be on uh, television. So yeah, and we'll also be and probably all across social media as well. Oh, and yeah, we'll all have snippets socials. throughout the shows uh, yeah. on, on, t on televised shows as well, too, Pretty Show and whatnot. So, yeah, yeah, for sure. 100 yeah, yeah. Yeah. Of course, we'll make sure to follow both of you on IG. Yes. You guys are on TikTok now. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? One hundred percent. Can, can well, Gemma's get on that. Yeah, yeah I gotta, I gotta yeah, do work. Let's get on that. Yeah, I gotta do work. But I do have to ask you this one last question before yeah, we wrap. Sure. Yeah. So you know, obviously, you know, we in Canada, so many people celebrate both their heritage, right. right? Whether For you're real. Canadian, For you sure. could be Jamaican, you mm -hmm. could be British, you could yep. be all these things. We see it during the World Cup. We're gonna see it during the Olympics. But you know, what gonna happen if, let's say, you know during the relay race it's like you know jamaica and canada and it's like mm. one two oh. one two like which flag are you gonna raise that's the question you see it's funny because <laughs> if, we, if we go to there's like only the one fact, answer <laughs> oh, not really because we're for first of all we're grenadian yeah, right? yeah. so yeah. if grenada's involved first well, that was of all, a trick question because it's for the jamaicans they were watching you go that's what i was about, about to say i'm about to say i'm gonna let the jamaican because many jamaicans own us anyway yeah and right. believe that we're jamaican anyhow but if you're from a certain country yeah. and you don't know if you should do Jamaica, or you should be Canada. Yo, just wait a boat to them, man. We go win no matter. Because yeah, he's what. a bandwagoner. Yeah. So yeah, he'll. he'll I have for the always winner. been with the winner. There's yeah. nothing wrong with yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why would I follow anything? J, else? hey, him, Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> Mark and Jeb, this is such a pleasure. No, congratulations. No, enough love, love, man. From Thank our you. audience, from me personally, from my team. Mm. Congratulations, kill it. We can't wait to so see you guys soar. Thank you, friend. And uh, CBC, let's make this like a continuous thing. Hey, it's BG and I want to know, what do you think about what you just watched? Make sure to drop your thoughts in the comments below, but also make sure to check out even more great content like this video and this video over here. And if you haven't subscribed to The Branding Gona Show, do so right now by clicking this button right here.